Hi there, and welcome to our series of tutorial videos. Today we are going to talk about Hootronic, part of our extensive range of electronic horn sounders, capable of faithfully reproducing traditional electromechanical alarm sounds with unsurpassed digital clarity and zero maintenance. The Hootronic range devices contain studio recordings of legacy alarm sounds, including an industrial klaxon, two mechanical sirens, a bell, and solenoid buzzer. The latest Class D amplifier technology provides a very high sound output level and CD quality playback. The Hootronic product range is available in different sizes and materials to suit any application. The industrial versions are available in lightweight, durable enclosures and can be combined with beacons and lights from our Spectra and Alerta light ranges with either a 5 joule Xenon LED or halogen rotating beacon in a choice of up to 7 lens colours. The explosion proof version, the BEX H120D, available with either flare or radio omnidirectional horn, is suitable for hazardous locations and are approved to ATEX, IECEX, EACEX, and in metro standards. The Hootronic range is offered in different operating voltages 10 to 30 volts DC, nominal 24 volts DC, and 24 115 and 230 volts AC 50-60 Hz. Unlike the traditional electromechanical devices, the Hootronic range is continuously rated, has low startup and running current, is maintenance free, and its signal quality and performance will not degrade with age. Today you're going to learn how to select the tones, how to replicate the alarm sound tail off. But first, let's have a look inside and explore the key features of the electronics. Starting clockwise, we have the tone selection jumper set, the sound of volume control, the three stage terminal connector, and the amplifier board with the heatsink. Hootronic has three stages or channels of alarm. This allows a number of different traditional tones to be triggered from a single device to suit a number of warning situations. To remotely switch to the second and third stage sounds, cable into the terminals marked S2 and S3 respectively. To activate the second and third stage sounds, switch S2 or S3 to the negative supply whilst the unit is powered. Stage 2 and stage 3 override stage 1. All Hootronic units have five user-selectable traditional sounds. Klaxon, high and medium frequency siren, bell and buzzer. Let's listen to them. Tone 1 is the industrial hooter. Tone 2 is a high frequency mechanical siren. Tone 3 is a medium frequency mechanical siren. Tone 4 is an electromechanical buzzer. Tone 5 is a mechanical bell. Each of these sounds has two additional remotely selectable alarm stages. The first stage tone is selected by positioning the supplied jumper connectors on the pin headers marked 1, 2 and 3 of the jumper set. The first stage selection will determine the sounds associated with stage 2 and 3. In the factory default position, the jumper connectors are both disconnected so the tone selection is tone 1, the industrial hooter for stage 1, Tone 3, the medium frequency siren for stage 2. And tone 5, the mechanical bell for stage 3. Moving the jumper connector on position 1 of the jumper set will define tone 2 for stage 1, tone 1 for stage 2, and tone 5 for stage 3. Moving the connector on position 2 will give tone 3 for stage 1, tone 1 for stage 2, and tone 5 for stage 3. Setting both connectors on position 1 and 2 will give tone 4 for stage 1, tone 1 for stage 2, and tone 5 for stage 3. Ultimately, by setting the connector on position 3 will establish tone 5 for stage 1, tone 1 for stage 2, and tone 2 for stage 3. The Hootronic sounder has the facility to replicate the tail off traditionally associated with the tones generated by electromechanical devices. To achieve that, just cable into the terminal marked stop on the terminal connector. 
the user can activate and deactivate the sounder by switching the connection between the stop wire and the negative supply line whilst the unit is powered. To achieve the tail off sound, the unit must remain powered. We hope you found this video helpful. You can find more information and step by step instructions in the Hootronic installation manual available at e2s.com.